A Floyd County school bus driver and former teacher pleaded guilty today in Floyd Circuit Court to one charge of sexual misconduct following a grand jury indictment going back to February. Floyd County school bus driver and former teacher John Martin pleaded guilty today and was sentenced to one year, two years probated to one charge of sexual misconduct with one of his former students dating back to almost 30 years ago. A grand jury handed down an indictment in the case on February 28th that included two charges against Martin, first degree rape and first degree sodomy. Those charges were amended to a charge of sexual misconduct in mediation a little over a week ago. In this case, uh, one of the elements that we would have to prove in order to convict for the first degree sodomy or first degree rape would be forcible consult, uh, compulsion. And uh, we just reached a point in this as we're investigating and getting ready for, uh, for trial that we felt like that we could not prove that element to the court. And a prosecutor is under an ethical duty uh, to refrain from prosecuting a case in which we feel that we cannot prove an element of the crime. And we felt like that we did not have the probable cause in this situation. The former student was given the opportunity to make a victim's statement during the hearing this morning. The victim was 16 at the time of the events. I, don't, I didn't get to have a normal childhood because I, I was being raped and sodomized for two years by you, Mr. Martin. And while the courtroom listened, the victim continued with her statement. I suffer from nightmares of you, Mr. Martin. And you're always chasing me and I can't get away. My psychologist says that I have complex post-traumatic stress syndrome. I have lived my whole life since I met you in high school as my teacher in survival mode, not wanting to be hugged or touched, not even by my own mother. At Audiology Associates of Prestonsburg, you can live your life the way you want and find the freedom of better hearing. With 40 years of being in the hearing care industry, you'll experience patient care that is specific to you with exceptional follow-up care that ensures your hearing and balance needs are being met. Audiology Associates at 1428 North Lake Drive in Prestonsburg. Martin pleaded guilty and has now been sentenced for having intercourse without the victim's consent beginning in August of 1995 through June of 1997, a time when sex-related offenses were prosecuted far differently under state law. And we found out it's the uh, law when it comes to sexual abuse, rape, and that sort of thing has changed a lot in those years. Uh, at that time, we would have to have the forcible compulsion that we don't have. Now, if that crime was committed today under the same circumstances, there's uh, at least one way that it would have been a felony. Uh, the uh, legislature changed the law in 2006 uh, that if a person is in a position of authority or a special trust, they would still have to be under the age of 16 at that time, then uh, it would be rape. Reporting for Mountain Top News, I'm Sheldon Compton.